Why is it bad if your animal eats a piece of string? I'm trying to create a visual representation, so please bear with me. So pretend this is the string that has been eaten by your pet. And so what often happens is it creates an anchor somewhere. So this is the anchor that's in like the stomach or underneath the tongue. And pretend that my holy genes are your intestines. So your stomach is connected to your intestines and this string will try and move through your intestines. Now the way that your intestines work, they're kind of like an inchworm. They bunch and contract and move like this. It's called peristalsis to try and move things through. So this string is trying to move through, but it's stuck at this anchor. So your intestines start to bunch up trying to move this string through. And what ends up happening is this sawing motion occurs as your intestines go through peristalsis and it can cut through your intestines. And this is why string foreign bodies or linear foreign bodies, linear meaning line essentially, are so difficult to deal with surgically because they make these little kind of cuts as your intestines are trying to move them through.